Aircraft Zulu left tower turning into Bravo Airspace, house coming to 304. No. Here's the beauty. She is going all the way down. Kurt TV, hello from Kurdistan. Nice, JB. Entertain, educate, and have fun. I might keyword you trim your beard. You trim your beard, Roger, Roger one that. Tower, one more kilo is uh, about two miles south. You uh, did your sheep, okay. Uh, <laughs> Thank you for the update, Sandra. 131 likes. If you haven't liked the, the stream yet, make sure you do so. Like and subscribe. Appreciate all of you. It's a good question. Another 737-8 max. Well, I have a moment. Again, a uh, big thank you to uh, Dreamweaver, ultimate economy member for six months, Trucker Norm. Also, thank you, Charlie Travis Ford Michaels, Ground. gifting memberships, Trucker Norm gifting memberships, Michael Walker, Tom Marchant, Yin Cathay has been premium economy yeah, well, member for two back. months. Richard Zeinert sent a 499 super chat, Orange Cone Vlog, two months of Ultimate Economy, Michael Walker, gifting memberships, Aviation LAA gifting memberships, Dream for his little, holy cow, this is one sharp son of a gun. Gulfstream alert. 15 minutes. Tower, one more kilo, uh, can we request to scoot a little bit more inward over to the center of the construction area? One more kilo, say again. I'd like to turn over uh, more to the uh, west side to, to shoot the construction site at, no uh, in the middle. <laughs> Well, now see, Trucker Norm, now I got an idea for a t shirt. The game. There's our Gulfstream G600. I just missed that 7500. For those of you who are not aware, Bombardier has a hangar here and so does Gulfstream. I don't know if it's a finishing plant or just a maintenance, uh, but they do have a presence here, both Bombardier and Gulfstream. I know, no lemon on us, David. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to reconcile that with Sandra because she loves Love Field. One three left turn there, left on Charlie, and you go into Gulf Stream Charlie five, Charlie Gulf Stream. Ground point seven five, we'll get you over there. Three days, Gulf Stream. Another Gulf Stream. It's like a G five, G six party over here. Charlie 3, traffic going to the park. Exodus, Charlie 3, Charlie 3. Our credit is 267, number 2 for the visual. 
257 left, tower continue from way 13 right. Southwest 581, Harnap door set, runway 13 right, clear for takeoff. 13 right, clear for takeoff, Harnap to door set, Southwest 581. Southwest 3198, runway 13 right, clear to land, wind 060 and niner. Runway 13 right, Dave, you got quite the little setup, man, with your four screens and your radios. Yeah, Michael, I know you like them. You're a big fan. Taylor Swift, are you there? No. Taylor Swift is not in there. I do not have my pilot's license. I have my flight dispatcher's license, John, but I do not have a pilot's license. Foxtrot, uh, don't climb anymore, please. The altimeter is 3042. 3042, Foxtrot, for Alpha Foxtrot. 507, runway 13, right clear to land. Oh, very cool, David. Roger that. Thanks, everybody, for liking and subscribing. If you're new to the channel, JetSuite X. Oh, you got a channel idea, huh? Gulf stream into the sky. You guys know when Alaska's coming in? I don't know. I'll ask it later. <laughs> that was, From a six -year -old that was pretty good. Oh, like JetBlue? Go ahead. Hmm. Hey, Citizen Tal, greetings from East uh, yeah, Dallas. Thanks for streaming. Well, thanks for tuning in, and thanks for letting me know where you're, where you're from. <laughs> What's up, Telly? Yeah, Citizen Tal, uh, this is episode 239, and I actually live in Frisco, so... We kind of rotate between DFW and Love Field, maybe the uh, Joint Reserve Base in Addison. So thanks so much for tuning in. Pleasure having you. Uh, for the JetBlue, I would probably say the Celtics then. The Celtics logo, or the Celtics JetBlue plane is really sharp. So yeah, the Celtics. Hard to take up off your right, southwest. Upwest 2980, only 13 right, clear to land. Land 13 right, southwest 2980. Look out to 60 Bravo Kilo, radar contact, half a mile east of uh, Methodist, and looks like altitude indicating 700. Low level is approved. A little altitude, thank you, man. I appreciate that. 60 Bravo Kilo. Welcome. The one where you be departing to the north? Uh, yes, ma'am. Looks like going to add it. We're moving right along. Well, another Gulf Stream. This big boy. Look at this big boy, big private jet. Oh, we got some buffering. We got some buffering. Hey, Edo. Look at this big old mamma jamma. Is this a 750, 7500 global? Look at this. Mamma Jamma. I can see you now, Ado. I can see Adrian Orford Peace. 
Director Lima Lima here at turn left, Charlie 4, contact ground 0.75 off the runway. Have a good one. That's that Charlie 4, that's that ground 1 to 1, decimal 75 up there, like 800, and that's good day. Look at this mamma jamma. Bubbling one zero zero at six. Pretty much, yeah, the private version of the CRJ. Theoretically, I think the majority, if not all, of the transatlantic, oh, and Japan Airlines, Korean doesn't. But theoretically, there could be, I think, a 10, 10 different airlines flying the A350 to DFW, in theory. This is 4174 left tower. This is just switched over with you 13 right. 4174, only one through I continue traffic. We'll hold in position prior to arrival. Expect landing clearance, two mile final. Good, good. You said this 4174. This is 673 left tower, traffic, four mile final. We're one through right, run up and wait, be ready. Five away, one through right. This is 670. And what do we get here? An Embraer Legacy, I believe. The private jet version of the E-135. <laughs> he turned down that thrust in the very last minute to try and make Charlie 4. I like that. I give that that crew and whoever flew that props. That's that's nice work right there. Six seven three traffic two mile final are now two door set and then one three right. Clip take. That is some nice work. Oh Maryland one from Vegas. Roger that. Thank you, Mirjin. Nice, nice, Rainy Cajun. Don't, no, now don't talk about food. I still got a couple hours to go. Dang it! <laughs> I guess this is their ghost plane. Oh, check this out. I think this is an old Alaska A320. Look at the tail. Look at the tail. Look at the tail. Yeah. Good thinking, Benjamin. Look at that. It's the old Alaska. Which means it's the old Virgin. It's the old Virgin. The old Alaska, which means it's the old Virgin. Virgin America. Red stripe. Red stripe. It's like the old beer. Thank you, Benjamin. From Houston Hobby. Big stripe. Excuse me. My apologies. Contact ground point seven five off the runway. Have a good one.
All right, Audrey, we'll see you later. Take care. We'll catch you next time. Have a fantastic evening, Audrey. Well, power, but that car one. Lone, Lone Star Executive in Conroe. Thanks, Ben. Oh, Uncle Lingo, I appreciate you. Uh, Kevin Kelly, I believe it is on the center part. Just it's uh, by the terminal, I believe. Try and keep things fresh and funny, but also educational. I was a flight dispatcher for two airlines for almost five years, and I did an internship with Air Ops as well. So I've got some technical and educational background too. So thanks everybody. Oh, this is a nice DeSalle Falcon. You said a 2X or a 2000? This is the airport where you see the corporate jets because we're so close to downtown Dallas. We're about a 30 minute drive to the Cowboy Stadium, FYI. Quite an ego on this Sandra Pollock lady. Ah, uh, there goes the global. Hold short, Charlie Kent. Roger, hold short, Charlie Kent, under this one. Thank you. Kendrick, what's up? Ah, look at this beast. Look at this beast. That's the budget option. Moxie 215, that was great landing, but you were slightly left to center. Moxie 250, tell you are correct, I was slightly left to center. And my first officer was slight. <laughs> Slightly right of the line. <laughs> Cue the Darth Vader march. No, I am sorry, uh, Kendrick. I will play the drums for him. This looks like some new engines they got on there. Yeah, Delta does a lot of the charters that will come in for basketball. Uh, for the NBA and also for the uh, Texas Rangers a lot of times. Charlie the next one left on Charlie, 0.75 for the rest. 
I know, my mic is on crack. It kind of does. So I think I'm going to I'm going to pull it out, pull out the uh, mic. I think the wiring's just a bit wiry. It's just a bit loose. There goes Maryland. I almost said Carolina. Combining Arizona and Maryland. Maryland one. Let's get that right. 